Hi friends, welcome to Leslie's Living Room. Today I have a story for you by Don and Wood and Audrey Wood and illustrated by Don Wood called The Little Mouse, the Red Ripe Strawberry, and the Big Hungry Bear. So look at that big bear. All right, let's read. Now don't forget, I'm gonna read the story first, then I'll turn the pictures around for you to see. So I need you to be a little patient. Are you ready? Okay, shh. Turn on your listening ears and turn up the volume. Here we go. Hello, little mouse. What are you doing? Oh, I see. Are you going to pick that red, ripe strawberry? But little mouse, haven't you heard about the big hungry bear? How's he feeling right now? What do you think he's thinking? thinking about it. Oh, how that bear loves red, ripe strawberries. Is he getting a little nervous, you think? How else might he be feeling? Scared, maybe? Yeah. The big, hungry bear can smell a red, ripe strawberry a mile away. Especially one that has just been picked. Boom, boom, boom. The bear will tromp through the forest on his big, hungry feet and sniff with me. Do it with me. Sniff, sniff, sniff. Find the strawberry. Pretend like you're the big, hungry bear and you're sniffing to find the strawberry. No matter where it is hidden, where is he hiding it? Yep, under the dirt. Hmm. Think that's useful? If he hides it under the dirt, then what? Is he going to be able to eat it? What will he have to do before he can eat it? Yeah, I think he'd have to wash it off too. Or who's guarding it? How is he guarding it now? What's he doing? He's marching like a soldier with a key because he has it all wrapped up in what? Yeah, a chain and a lock. Isn't that funny. Or how it's disguised. You'll like this one. Can you find the strawberry in that picture? Yeah, you could. You're being the big hungry bear. Quick, there's only one way in the whole wide world to save a red ripe strawberry from that big hungry bear. What do you think is the way that we should save that strawberry so that the big hungry bear doesn't find it? What do you think we can do? see what the mouse does. Cut it in two. That's another word for cutting it into two pieces. It's another word for that. Yeah, it's called cutting it in half. Share half with me.
and we'll both eat it all up. Yum. Poor big hungry bear. There's no strawberry. I'm sorry, we ate it on you. Now there's one red, red ripe strawberry the big hungry bear will never get. Where's that strawberry now? In the mouse's belly and in my belly. The end. Do you think there's really a big hungry bear? Or do you think that the author or the person reading the story was just making it up to make the mouse nervous that he, so he would share the strawberry? What do you think? Thinking face. Can you think of another way to write the story? Can you change the characters or add a different ending? Maybe you can do that at home. I hope you enjoyed the story today. I love this story, it's a lots of fun. And don't forget to wash your hands front, back, back, in between, said front, back, in between. Don't forget the thumbs. Don't forget the fingernails. Don't forget under any jewelry. And don't forget 20 seconds, count slow. Or you can sing happy birthday two times through. But if it's not your birthday, that might get boring. Or you can sing the alphabet from the beginning to the end. Or you can ask your family to download 20 second songs to wash your hands by on the internet. Or you can set a kitchen timer for 20 seconds. However you do it, do it slow and do it right so that you can stay healthy. And don't forget if you have to cough or sneeze, do so in your elbow. If you don't have long sleeves on, wash that with soap and water to get rid of all the germs. And don't forget, if you get that runny feeling under your nose, or you get feel like something's in there and you need to get at it, don't use your finger. If your finger gets dirty, it gets germs. If you lick it, you lick that stuff up, it's got germs in it, it's gross. Get a tissue, wipe your nose, blow your nose, throw the tissue away, and then do, what do you do? You're right, wash your hands, 20 seconds. Front, back, back, in between, so front, back, in between, don't forget the fingernails, don't forget the thumbs, don't forget, under any jewelry, I almost forgot. 20 seconds, count slow, and I hope to see you real soon.